Hello, everyone. Happy Wednesday. How are you guys doing tonight? <coughs> I am fine. Just love this weather. Up, down, up, down, up, down, and everybody get sick. Great. <clears throat> so, tonight we're talking about soaks. What are soaks? Well, soaks are basically our liquid form of sprinkles. They can be used everywhere, on anything, on anybody, and just about any animal. Just about. Not on birds. We don't want to do that. Um, they come in a 3.75 ounce bottle. This one's been used. This is my Inhale Exhale. It's new this spring summer catalog. They are $14 a bottle. They come with either the squirt nozzle or a spray cap. Uh, you get one in the box. So it'll look like this when you open it up. It'll have one of these in there as well. So, But they have a variety of scents that you can use. Um, they last a really, really long time. Um, I have one of our wall hugs. And I showed you this in our Mother's Day video of one of the gift ideas that you can get your mom or yourself. Um, these are our wall hugs. This is just a plain nondescript wall hug. A little uh, plug on the back. When you get it, it might be turned sideways like that. It just spins over and you can plug it in. This is removable and this is where you'd put your, oops, where you put your soaks in. And then you have your little on off switch down below and it has a really subtle light. So it's not going to be really like bright at late at night when you're going to the restroom or what have you. It's just a really soft glow, but you can use your fragrances in there. This was a brand new bottle. I had filled up my wall hug in my bathroom, probably to about where this curves in. And that was, about a month ago and it's finally down about right here and it still smells really good <laughs> um, they are $14 a bottle and they come like I said in a variety of scents now you can use this anywhere if you use Glade or Febreze this will do the same thing but will smell much nicer and it works a lot better as far as my opinion. You need to try yourself. Um, but we also have our reed sets. This is just the um, regular natural reed set. It's $14. And it will come like this. Um, so when you get your box, it will come in a pink zebra box. Um, you'll notice it'll, it won't have that sticker on it because this is one of my old bottles. But it will look like this. Now this bottom part is glass. And our bottles are plastic. What you do is that you take off the empty one. Keep it, though. Um, these are usually bundled up. Just take off the paper. And what you do is take your new bottle or take a bottle of soaks. Twist off your little squirt tab. And spray some in like so. Now, you can put the whole bottle in there if you'd like. It's up to you. It doesn't really take that much. And what I usually do, when I use this, it's usually filled about halfway. And then I tip it upside down and let all of the soak get down through the reeds. And then tip it back. Let them drain. And then take off my bottle. And you're ready. To set it on your shelf or I don't know maybe outside I wouldn't set it outside though <clears throat> because all the other smells around you will probably overpower it <laughs> being outside like fresh cut grass or something like that um, one of I think the greatest soaks that we have 
and we have it brought back every summer is our green tea lemongrass. I think this stuff is amazing. I basically spray this on my grandchildren, on myself. I'll even spray it on the dog. It helps keep mosquitoes away. This is awesome. I mean, yeah, you can buy the citronella candles and you're outside and have all your little tiki torches going, all the little candles going just to try to keep your area clean and bug free. But this stuff really works nicely, if I may say so myself. Um, another option is that we have our just hang it and our go cards. Our go cards. Come in a packet of four. And these ones are our paisleys. And these ones are so simple. They're not scented. They're just like little cardboard cards. They come with a hanger. And what you do for these is that when you open your pack, you squirt your soak in, you seal it up, and then you smush all around sit for like five minutes to make sure it really soaks into that card and once that five minutes is done take it out of your package and you can hang that anywhere you want hang it in a closet hang it in your kitty litter box hang it in your bathroom hang it in your car hang it in your husband's work boots if they stink really bad <laughs> or maybe hang put it just put it in your gym bag to help keep your clothes smelling kind of fresh. In a drawer. You can go just about anywhere you are. In a camper. You know, sometimes when you open the camper up from it's sitting all winter, it's kind of musty. That's where our Air Care Plus soaks come in handy because that is basically an odor neutralizer. Kind of like the Febreze is, right? But it neutralizes the odors plus leaves a really really good scent it's kind of on the floral side that's a nice light floral i think um at least for me it is <clears throat> if you have artificial flowers artificial flowers you just take your soaks you can switch it to the spray and just spray your flowers set it in the center of your table or if you have them on a bookshelf it adds scent to the room really easy um, another thing i like to do is i have those wool dryer balls um, they usually come two in the pack and they're about two dollars i think anywhere from 99 cents to two dollars depending on where you shop um i squirt a few little squirts of the just soaks or just few little squirts of the soaks onto my dryer balls and I throw them in the dryer with my damp clothes it's better than fabric softener softener I think and you get the scent that you want it's great um, changing the furnace filter changing your filter in your furnace you have to do that year round um, I know for our system it's the furnace and air conditioning so we are changing it every about every two to three months go downstairs i spray whatever i'm in the mood for that time uh, i have himalayan sea salt or i'll spray the air care plus um, on the air filter itself and then put it into the furnace and so that just per permeates through the whole house i love it it's great sweepers most sweepers today are bagless. Well, yes, they are bagless. You don't have to do too much to them, but you still need to maintain your sweeper. You still need to clean out the filters or purchase new filters. I usually just clean mine out. Warm, soapy water, you know, scrub them out really good, let them dry. And what I do is I spray my soaks on it. <clears throat> that way, whenever I sweep the floor, they just scent fills the room it's great um you use it on furniture as far as like the material i wouldn't use it on leather but you can use it on furniture carpets curtains bedding 
um, yourself, if you have a particular scent that you like and you really like that scent, you can spray it on yourself. I mean, I love Himalayan sea salt. Unfortunately, it's not available in this catalog in this form, only in sprinkle form. But I love this stuff. It's just great. On your animals. Didn't have time to take the dog to the groomer and you have company coming over and the dog kind of smells nasty. Squirt, squirt. If he has a collar or she has a collar, squirt it on the collar if you don't want to squirt it on the dog. That way he's not, he or she isn't that smelly. Um, cats. Okay. I would, now if you're introducing a new kitten to a home that already has a cat or two, I would put a little bit on your hand, rub them on both hands, and then pet your kitties, and then pet the new kitten a little bit. That way the scent is kind of the same. I've done that with a couple of our cats, so it works out quite well, let me tell you. Um, goodness. Work boots. I wear steel toe boots during the day. <clears throat> yeah, I'll squirt some air care plus in them. Not that my feet, my feet stink or anything like that, but just from my knowing that they smell okay, I'll squirt some of that in there. Um, smelly gym bags, kids' rooms, kids' gym bags. You know how teenage boys get, especially if they're in sports. <sighs> Sometimes it smells like a dead animal in their rooms. <laughs> You've got to find this find out where it's coming from. Um, but yeah, teenage boys definitely squirt that with their football gear or something in their bags, in their shoes, get a couple of the little go cards and maybe stick it in their drawers or maybe in their gym bag. That way it doesn't smell so bad. Um, in your vehicle, this is great. I have, um, we had last year like little seashells and whatnot and seahorses in our just hang -its. I have one in my car and I changed the fragrance. So after a while, you know, it will, it will fade away. I have, um, and I'll just use the little baggie again, get the little baggie out, put the coat, the go card in there, put it fill it up with my favorite scent a couple of squirts or maybe just one squirt close seal it up let it soak and then put it back in my car and it smells so good um two 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 campers yeah anywhere that you don't have electricity <clears throat> and you don't have or you don't want to use like a simmering light here or a simmer pot to where you have to plug it in and use sprinkles, the soaks are a great alternative to all of that. Um, hmm. So we get sweepers, furnace builders, dryer balls, yourself. I mean, yeah, it's in general purpose, all purpose product as far as fragrance is concerned you cannot go wrong with using soaps um there are a few fragrances that we have <clears throat> and i'll just run down the list really quick we have agave melon air care plus of course aloha flower which smells absolutely amazing oh my goodness i have that in sprinkle form and I love it. Aquamarine, which is another great scent. Um, black cherry for you cherry lovers. Fireside vanilla, which is a really nice, like toasty vanilla. It makes you feel warm and cozy. Um, fresh cucumber melon smells really good as well. Fresh sweet strawberries for a strawberry lover. It does smell really good. Green tea lemongrass, again, green tea lemongrass, great for summer. Get a few bottles, keep them on hand, keep them in your purse, keep them in the car, keep them in your camper. 
keep them, keep one in the house. <clears throat> I'm telling you, mosquito repellent, awesome. And you don't have to worry about all those chemicals that they put in like off and the other stuff. And it doesn't leave that nasty taste in your mouth. I don't know if you get what I mean, you know. You spray that stuff on and all of a sudden you're like, you're tasting it. It's like, ooh, no. Um, honeysuckle. If you love honeysuckle, perfect. I love honeysuckle. I love watermelon. If you love watermelon, there it is. Um, inhale, exhale. Another really nice, clean, very light but it's so soothing, um, which is this one. This is what I have in my bathroom right now going in my wall hug. I love this. And it's, like I said, it's really light. It's just calm. <laughs> That's why I have it in my bathroom. Um, Island Breeze, a great summertime scent. Juicy Air Care Plus. Of course, it's Air Care Plus and it's orange. Laundry Fresh. Laundry Fresh reminds me of like either Downy or Bounce. Mahogany Wood, a great, nice masculine scent. Midnight Waters, another masculine scent, which smells really good. Um, Morning Delight. <clears throat> now, I actually made Morning Delight last year um, out of my energy soaks in the Juicy Air Care Plus. Energy, unfortunately, is not in this catalog, but it was half and half. I mixed it just like the sprinkles, and that was Morning Delight. It smells amazing, and I actually have a bottle, one of these bottles in my car with that mixture in it, so whenever I feel like it's not smelling good in there, I squirt it. Um, Orange Mango Mai Tai, a nice fruity tropical type scent. Peruvian Lime. Pink Pineapple, which was our number one seller last year. I do believe that came out as a Paisley pick for June last year. And it was part of our hostess um, scents for June. We could not keep that in stock. It was such a big hit that this year we just actually brought it into our catalog and just have it all the time. I love it. I had bought two cartons last year, plus I found more, <laughs> but it's almost gone. Um, the relaxed lavender or vanilla would be really, really good for a bedroom. I burned the relaxed lavender and vanilla for um, sprinkles in my simmer pot by my bed. It just relaxes me and I fall right to sleep. Um, the Royal Blue Citrus is another great one. Um, as far as it's summertime, it's kind of orangey, a little tropical, but not too much. You get a lot more of an orange type scent to it. Sea salt and vanilla smells amazing. Spring cleaning, again, a nice clean scent, cleaning. <laughs> um, sweet Summer Blooms, if you are a floral person, this is a great scent. Tango Mango, <clears throat> Thai Lemon Air Care Plus, another air neutral or, or odor neutralizer. Tropical Infusion smells really good. It's nice and fruity. Um, I know I have that in a sprinkle. I don't have that in a soak. And Vanilla Sage. Vanilla Sage smells really good. And if you mix, and you can mix them just like you do the sprinkles. You take two scents and you mix them together. Now, you don't have to actually mix them until you smell them together. So what I mean is if you have, um, say, this one is the Himalayan sea salt and I have inhale, exhale. So I'm going to smell what these two smell like together without mixing it and finding out I don't like it. So what I do is I, just like you do the sprinkles, you open up your, your jars or your bottles. And you just smell. Now these two smell really good together. <clears throat> I like that. Make sure I have that on the right one. Because I don't want the caps to get mixed up. Um, yeah, that's, 
like I said, it's just like her sprinkles. I mean, you've got a couple bottles of the scents that you think you will like or that you know you'll like. So you have these bottles sitting here and it's like, why not get creative? Open those bottles up. Sniff two of them together. See if you like it. If not, open the other bottle up. Sniff those together. See if you like it or the opposite too. You never know. You may create your own scent that you will enjoy forever. <laughs> But yeah, that's our soaps. Like I said, they're 3.75 ounce bottles. A little bit goes a long way. So these bottles will last you a while. Like I said, I got this about a month ago. This is all much I used out of it. And that was filling my wall hug. And my wall hug is still going. And that's been 30 days. Just saying. But we also have different reed sets. If you don't like just the basic reeds here, um, I can show you a couple of them. Because I don't have, I have, well, oh, I, do. I don't know where it's at. But I have the perfume bottle one, which is this one right here. I love that one. And we have a little lion. And this beautiful white vase with the blue flower. And this is like like a beachy type theme. It's the light blue with the little waves in there. And then we have our Just Add Soaks, which is our Wally the Whale and our little pelican. And then here's the other reed sets as well, the natural reeds. So we have this one, which I showed you. And then we have the tops in different colors if you like those and then our wall hugs if you want to be more decorative you can get the one with the leaf or for a baby's room or for a kitchen these are all cute and like I said, there's a lot of different reads so and then we have our go cards these are our go-cards, our paisleys that I showed you. Then we have dice and our um, poker chips and a cards. And then we have a little elephant, a flip-flop, the love, faith, hang it, and then a little book bag. But there's a lot more in this catalog. And I have the link in the description of this video if you want to go to the catalog and check it out. Be my guest. If you have any questions, just let me know. Um, just put it down in the comments or what have you, and I'll be more than happy to answer those for you. But that pretty much sums up soaks. So I hope you have a wonderful rest of your evening and join me again next Wednesday at 6 p.m. And uh, we'll talk about Set words. I'll see you there. Bye.